Ladies and gentlemen, Benny Franklin, Colonial Comic. Da 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 Hey folks, great to be back in my green country town. I'll tell you, it's tough being a colonist. Took a horse and buggy here, it cost me $17.76. I gave him $18.12 and told him to keep the change. That's right, folks. Ran into George Washington yesterday, complaining about his teeth. I felt so fortunate I wanted to knock wood, so I punched him in the mouth. Excuse me. Yes. Betsy. Betsy. Green, purple, and mauve? No, oh, red, white, and blue, and don't forget the stripes. Wish I thought of that. Speaking of Betsy Ross, ran into her last night <clears throat> at the Plymouth Rock Cafe. Should have seen the fireworks. She got drunk and they flagged her. That's right, life is tough. My wife left me, said it was her Declaration of Independence. Ah, uh, my constitution hasn't been the same since I fell off that horse. <clears throat> Excuse me? Directions to the bell? Go to make a left, make a right, and after that it's oneth by land and twoeth by sea. Here's one for you. A silversmith, a signer, and a pilgrim walk into a bar. The bartender says, what is this, a joke? Ran into Thomas Jefferson yesterday. Last time I saw him, he was knee-high to a nickel. Asked my wife what was for dinner. She said, mutton, honey. I'll tell you. So John Hancock asked for his autograph. Darn near ran out of ink. Did I ever tell you my mother and father came over on a covered wagon? If you saw my family, you know why the wagon was covered. That's right, folks. See you on the 4th. Da 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 da